Third down and nine. Young throws, and that's incomplete. And down. 49ers quarterback Steve Young was another one of Lee Steinberg's clients. A sight that is the last thing in the world the 49ers would want to see. It looks as almost as if he's out cold. Now I've been there. There he is. And there he is. He's up. That's a good sign. And what I like is he wants to get up off the ground. Look at this. He looks like he's out cold, and now he's walking off. I remember thinking as I walked the sidelines, this is, this is not good. You know, this is just not the right thing to happen. It was Young's seventh concussion. Well, that's a sight we thought would be impossible. Steve Young apparently knocked cold, knocked out cold, walks off the field. He would never play again. If my knee is hurt, everyone knows it and I know it and we can go deal with it. And shoulders, and there's only one place in your body that you really don't understand. And the, people always say the brain is the last frontier. For Steinberg, there was a growing recognition of just how dangerous the sport was. The damage was occurring every week. And I had people who I loved and cared for. And I intuitively knew that this was not just a football issue that it was happening to football players in the pros, it was happening in college, it was happening in high school, it was happening to every player in every collision sport. So not only was it an issue for my clients, it was a huge societal issue. For my running back brothers, I mean, that's the truth. You talk about a nefarious injury, one that you never feel until it's too late. So that's, the, that's just, as I look back over 30 years of, of uh, associated with football, that's the thing that's most alarming to me.